Hey, this is Chris Hess from WP for businesswebsites.com. I recently had someone ask me how to create a blog role on a WordPress website. Now, for those who may not know, a blog role is basically a list of links to other websites or blogs. Um, and they really could be a list of links to anything, internal posts or you know whatever you want. Um, but in this particular instance, they were looking for a way to make a list of links on the side of their site that pointed to other people's websites. Um, the way we can do this, we log into our WordPress site, we go to the dashboard, and there is a menu called links. Uh, and if we click all links, we can actually see that there's a bunch of links here for different WordPress.org sites. Now these are default, and there's actually a category called blog roll. Um, if you come into the link categories, you can see blog roll and test. Um, now, if you're going to create a new one, you can just put it here, and if you want to put a description about it, you can. Add the category. We can now choose from these categories. We come back into the All Links menu here, and we could pick a couple of them that we want to work with. Oh, sorry, we can't check them. We can come in here, we can say we're going to add that to the test 2. We'll pick this one here. We'll add it to test 2. So you have the name of the link, the website, if you wanted a description, you can put that there. And then the categories. You can tell it to open in a new window, the same window, or um, inside a frame if you're in a frame. And so then there's some other things you can do if you want to put some categories, relationships here. I know this person um, or her colleague, things like that. In most cases, this is probably more than what you need. If you're going to do images, you can do that here. Um, and you can do a rating if you're going to rate the link. Um, so you create the link, you add it to the comments. The important part is the displaying it on your page. So if we come under Appearances, Widgets, there is going to be a widget called Links. And it even says your blog roll. So if we come up and put it in the primary sidebar, you can say show the link image if you put an image in there. Um, show the link name. And it would do all links. We can do blog roll. So we'll do that one first. So now if we come back to our website, we have blog roll listed right there. If we come back into the widgets, we change it from blog roll to test two. Refresh the page. The test two links are there. Let's say we actually want two sets of links. We can put test and test two. There you go, that's how you create a blog roll or a set of links on your blog.